So, man of the match, in what was a, a very defining uh, result for the Chiefs tonight? Yeah, it was a really good result. We had a bit of a, a, bit of a slow start there, a uh, couple of mistakes, and we let in two early tries. Um, second, uh, the, first, the second half of the first half was a bit better, sort of clawed it back a bit, had a few opportunities that we sort of blow, blown, and uh, the second half was a lot better. Came out, and we knew we had to carry for a brick wall because our defence is pretty solid, and we managed to wear it down a bit. They got a bit tired and we, we capitalised on that. Yeah, I was going to say, at times it was brutal out there. The collisions were, were fairly some, hefty. Yeah, there were some big old hits out there. I'm sure the <laughs> boys will be pretty pretty sore tomorrow. So yeah. And in terms of it, though, it's a big scalp, though, isn't it? Sar Saracens on their own patch. Yeah, definitely. It's always really tough to come up here and get a result. Um, and obviously, with the, with the league table the way it is, um, it just puts us a bit more um, a few points clearer for them. So it's a really good result for us. Rob talked about just changing a few things at half time and felt you kind of coasted into the game if you can but uh, second half in particular you cranked up the gears yeah like, like I said I think that the second half we just yeah. knew that we had to be patient with the ball um, and we had like I said we carry through brick walls and we, we wear them down that way um, there's not a lot of space when you play Saracen so that's the way you got to play and we, you know, we, we put in people kicks and it's all about the, the energy and the kick chase and it, the small little things like that so the lessons you've learned over recent years though are clearly coming through especially on days like today yeah, definitely. Um, you know, in recent years we might have let that slip away after the start we had, but we we had the confidence there that we knew we could we could uh, claw it back and you know get the result we wanted. So heading towards halfway stage of the season, uh, top of the pile. It's not a bad place to be, but Bath at home next week is a tough, tough game. Yeah, well, we you know it's tough after after last year's defeat against them, um, and you know every every game is tough. So we and they're going well at the minute. We we're going right. We there's still there's still a room for improvement. Um, but we're looking forward to it and it's good to be back at home again. As a local lad, does a derby game add a little bit of spice to things? Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's always it's always good when you play Bath. The, the atmosphere is always buzzing, so it'll always be you know day off tomorrow, recover a bit, and then I'll be buzzing for the weekend. You're gonna say a nice bus journey home tonight, then? Yeah, I'm sure. Sure, a few, few minutes as well.